Hey guys, welcome back to another video of All Things Nerd. Uh, I just saw that they came out with the Sons of the Forest official gameplay trailer. I haven't seen it yet. Been really excited for this game to come out. I uh, played the crap out of the first game. Uh, bought it on PC, played with friends, had a lot of fun on there. Um, I've always enjoyed games that have crafting, base building, and I remember the first time I discovered the cave systems and it <laughs> creeped the crap out of me. Uh, I remember I wouldn't play by myself unless I had friends with me because I, I hated exploring the caves. Uh, rebought it on console, horrible performance, but still, regardless, a lot of fun if you have a lot of friends to play with. Um, so we're going to be checking out the trailer here, see uh, what's what, and um, yeah, I'm excited. Here we go. The graphics look even better. Holy crap. I like how the sounds are still the same. That's awesome. Okay, so it looks like they have somewhat the same mutated people. Oh my god. Dude, that's terrifying. Oh yeah. I'm so excited for the new loadouts that they're going to have, or at least the new weapons, you know? Oh, that's awesome. So it's like a bunker system. That's sick. Oh, wow. Oh, this is giving me like PT vibes. Dude, that mask is so scary. What? What is that about? Hold on. I gotta I got go back. I hate when people go back in videos. I hate when people pause, but I have to go back. Wait, hold on. Mask. Five seconds, 10 milliliters available. Oh, it's a 3D printer. That's oh, Wait, you can 3D print stuff in the game? Is that gonna be like an actual thing? <laughs> I was like, what is the point of that? Dude, these zombies are... Uh, Cannibals, whatever you want to call them. These guys are like freaky. Oh wow. Oh, you get a stun gun? Bro. 2021, I'm so excited. Oh man. Alright, well that was that. I mean, at least we got to kind of see, at least for me, more of a sneak peek into the kind of weapons or um, like the map somewhat, I don't know, seemed a little... A little bit the same, ex except for there's a lot more snow that you could explore, which I thought is uh, really cool. Because I've always wanted to explore up in the snow, in uh, in the forest, but there wasn't really much up there, at least to my knowledge. Um, it just kind of went uphill to the a mountain range, somewhat similar to this, but there wasn't much to explore. Like there wasn't how like right now, like obviously you could build the houses. You got the uh, the skin, was it the the little pellets right there? Uh, I can't remember what that item is what you would put on there um, unless it's just a skin rack uh is that what is that right there is that like solar panels or something else it almost looks like solar panels but yeah like i think this is cool you're gonna be able to explore totally different areas uh saw on there they had uh what was it just the graphics in this is beautiful look at this look at this right here the lighting the shading is so good huh it's gonna be like Far Cry 5 vibes, just kind of seeing this. Like, it reminds me of, um, what's her face with the bliss? I can't remember what her name was. That's a cool crossbow. Though. Yeah, these guys look freaky. Look at that guy. You got like a skull right there. So I wonder if you're gonna be able to find like body armor. Cause in the, in the forest you would find bones, you craft those, you know, lizard skins, whatever. Um, and then you can have the, uh, the skin from the monsters make heavier armor. But I'm wondering if you could get, like, police vests or something. Because I know the helicopter crashes. It's like a SWAT team. So I'm wondering if you're going to have more modernized equipment. You'll have, like, a vest, a uh, helmet, something else. I, I think it's going to be awesome if you do have that. It's going to be totally different. That gun looks awesome. The animations are great in this. So it looks like they kind of act the same or uh, behave the same as the horse. Look how realistic that is, though, when you're digging a hole. Look at that, with the, the mud breaking it. Bro. You see, like, little, uh, like, the dirt kind of spill off the side. 
The particles are just sitting on the floor. That bunker system is going to be pretty cool, though. I am excited for that. This just looks creepy. <laughs> I love the 80s vibes. So I wonder if you could... Being that there's the 3D printer, I'm, I'm wondering if you can maybe uh, 3D print weapons or just different items or if it's just a little knickknacks like that. I'm not really sure. Either way, that's that's gonna be pretty cool though. That's awesome that you can actually split the wood though. I, I wonder if that's like an actual crafting feature or if that's just kind of how you lay more logs. That's awesome though. You can like bump things like out of the way. So I'm curious if they're gonna make the game more interactive or if that's just an animation for like setting things up. That was pretty cool though. Like if you can make it a little more interactive, a little more realistic. The way that you kind of interact with the environment. That's going to be fun with friends, the stun gun. <laughs> well, there we go. That's going to be awesome. I'm so excited for this. Um, I mean, at least we saw like some gameplay there. I'm, I'm assuming that's in-game gameplay. Uh, obviously says on the title. But uh, all right. Yeah, hopefully maybe we'll get some more uh, gameplay on this soon. We'll definitely keep you guys updated. Uh, we recently restarted a website we had a couple of years ago. Uh, it's called All Things Nerd Blog, so go ahead and check that out. We'll be doing latest gaming news. Uh, we'll be posting our podcasts from YouTube onto the webpage, so you can kind of see everything centralized on there. Um, we have the videos embedded, so if you want to just stay on the website, read, listen to a podcast, everything is going to be on there. Uh, let us know if you guys have any you know questions or any suggestions on um, podcasts in the future or um, anything else. <laughs> We're definitely always taking suggestions. Uh, but I will catch you guys later in another video. Hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. I certainly did. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Take care.